I'm finna stand tall in it, I'm all in it You be on my back like a guard again Call her again, I'm in love with your friend Hey what's up guys, it's your girl I'm back at it again with another video And today I am going to be reviewing Two of the pairs of Jordans I recently just purchased Nor my freaking sunburn because it looks so bad Like it looks so uneven Okay, but also I've been hiking a lot And I feel good, you know I've been trying to eat healthier. I've been working out more. Now that quarantine's happening, I've been working out a lot more and like going hiking and going out. Also, I did get a hip tattoo. I do not want to get demonetized, but something funny. I'm not even monetized right now, so there's no way I can get demonetized. I will show like a little bit, you know, a little bit of it. Huh, that's pretty much it. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video and let's get on to it right now. As you can see, these are all my shoes, and I've done a video before on my shoe collection, so you guys pretty much know most of my shoes, but I recently just purchased these shoes, so you guys have never seen them. And they're the Air Jordan 1s, and let's see. Oh, did you see my tan line? That is not okay. Also, sorry for looking like a rat, but be like that in the video, so yeah, enjoy. Okay. So I'll start off with the UNC, they're women's shoes, and I believe I got them in a nine and a half. So I could have sized down because Jordans do run a little bit bigger, but I do like the way they fit. They're the glossy color, if you know the UNCs are glossy, but whatever. <laughs> and I freaking love these shoes, they are sexy. Like they are sexy on, and they you can pretty much wear them with anything, like black. Even though the colorway is only like, it's navy blue more than a black, I don't know if you can see it. It's definitely more navy, I mean it's like a dark, dark navy blue, but it's not black you know what i mean and the laces are navy blue as well i was looking into buying um new laces for one of them so they could be like a mismatch lace but i don't know and i do re recommend these shoes even if you're a guy just purchase them in a woman's size but like your size you know what i mean i mean no sense but you know i purchased these at a, a store that resells their shoes and buys shoes and it's called az thread and they're super super nice i love it so much they're, i live in arizona so there's a couple like high-end shoe stores like this there is az thread phoenix soul so if you don't know shoe stores in Arizona, I just gave you two. There is, I think I went to AZ Thread and Phoenix Soul, but there's another place, but I can't think of it. I did get these at AZ Thread. So if you're looking for a shoe store that has nice Jordans, AZ Thread. Wang's Closet, okay. Wang's Closet, Phoenix Souls, and AZ Thread. That's what it's called. Wang's Closet is also a good sh shoe store. I almost bought Obsidian's there. I just didn't end up getting them because they were like really worn out. And these ones were like brand new. I think they were brand new and then i kind of paid a lot for them okay 420 dollars with tax so like it was 400 which is a normal my shoe size is 400 i looked it up on StockX and go so it didn't rip me off but with tax it was 430 but i should have paid around like shipping and stuff if i did buy them on StockX. but i got them right there right then for the same price so yeah i love shoes i spend too much money on shoes all right my shoes are also sexy all my shoes are sexy i would say because i bought them I did a little photo shoot for my Instagram and everybody's like, what the freak are you doing? Is he like, what? Why are you posing with your shoes, weirdo? But yeah, it's me. I love shoes. I will marry my shoes right now. Don't test me. The only thing about Jordans is it's so hard not to crease them because you want to wear them a lot. And like, if you wear them a lot, they're going to be creased no matter what. Like, unless you like have toes that like lift up the top that do like, I guess that made no sense. But these are the multi-colored Jordans. Ones, they're mid though. They're not the high. And these are men. So I just literally got these yesterday and I styled them with just like leggings and oh like a tube top, whatever. And it looks cute. I'll show you. I'll put some pictures in like right here. And I'll show you, but whatever. Um Y'all y'all peep that too. Even my cat peeped that. Hey bro, oh my god. Even my cat said, what the fuck? I don't even know if I got her in the camera, but hey guys. Um I don't even know if it's the same angle and I look so busted. They are the mid color, or mid color, multi color Jordan 1. Men's size 8. Okay. I'm scared. I'm gonna cry right now. If that happens again, I'm literally moving out of my house, packing my bags, and getting the fuck out of here. What else was I gonna say about these shoes? I got interrupted by something. I don't know what the fuck that was. Uh, they're from Nike.com. And I got a huge discount on them. And also, the, the like texture of the blue and the um, red is like, not a velvet, but it's like, I mean, 
like it's not like a normal like air force texture or anything like that kind of how like the unc's are like a glossy it's like a felt you could describe it as and then it has this the swoosh has all of this yarn almost like yarn like threading into the swoosh and it's red blue what else purple and orange guys i'm scared <laughs> these are so sexy bro <laughs> my next cops i swear the next jordans i'm going to cop is probably going to be oof i don't know yellow toe jordans are so fire but <laughs> acting like I got thousand dollars in my pocket <laughs> but the yellow toe Jordans are fire I would I would definitely cop them if I was rich and could afford them you know dude I know I'm not just I know I'm not the only one that peeps that I'm gonna record it oh, guys guys it's happening right now hold on wait for it wait for it I swear if it doesn't happen when I'm recording you're lying you're lying what the hell also if you tie your jordans you're weird you're actually weird <laughs> don't tie your jordans everybody it looks better when they're untied and they're not tied oh <laughs> i literally just said the same thing mm. okay 10 on the 10 are what am i talking about oh <sighs> y'all i'm a mess i'm so sorry i have not done youtube in forever hold on let me put the little mic thing back on there we go. Okay. I rate the UNC UNC <laughs> the UFC fucking football. I'd rate the UNC's probably like a nine out of ten just because it is super easy to crease them, just like it is with any Jordan, but since it is like the glossy texture, it is easier to crease them, harder to match them with fits, you know what I mean? I don't know. Don't don't come at me for saying that. And the multicolor Jordans are fire. I, I don't care. You can match them with anything. You can match them with red, blue, orange, purple, white, black, and it, you'll look fire no matter what. Don't listen to anybody to tell you your outfit doesn't look fire when you're wearing the multicolor Jordans because you look fire and you are cute, okay? If you guys have any questions about Jordans or shoes, let me know. Let me know in the comments down below what you want your next cop, your next cop, your next shoe to be. Mine, personally, I want off-white Prestos, but again, I do not have a thousand dollars to just whip out and buy some shoes. <laughs> I just don't. And I'm not working right now because this quarantine shit and don't have money. Like, I have money, but I'm not trying to spend it. I need money for, like, shoe our shoes. <laughs> I would spend my money on sh my last money on shoes, but no, I need money for, like, food and stuff. My quarantine life has been so boring. So I will be making more videos, I promise you. Me and my friend Keyshawn are making are in the progress of wanting to make this video for you guys so i'll update you guys on that and everything also go follow my social media so you can get to know me better if you don't know me if you do know me i love you guys thanks for being on this journey with me i've been doing youtube for three years now and haven't even hit 1,000 subscribers which is pretty sad so get me there guys i love you so much but i love you guys so much remember to stay today <laughs> Remember to stay humble and stay hungry and have an amazing night or day whenever you're watching this and bye!